Hey there, Bridge family, it's Pastor Jeff. And today I wanna ask you a very personal question. I wanna ask you a personal and an eternal question. Are you ready? Here it is. Who's your daddy? Who's your daddy? You say, Pastor Jeff, what kind of question is that? Well, it's a personal question. It's an eternal question. It's a biblical question and it's a missional question. You see, we're looking at 1 Peter chapter 1, verse 14, and the opening three words refer to a people as obedient children. And in that phrase, we have loaded a question that brings to the surface what I've asked you, who's your daddy? Whose children are you a part of? Who's your daddy? Now, we know, for example, in the Bible's prayer that Jesus led the disciples in what we call the Lord's Prayer. He says, our Father. Well, who's the our? There is a children of God family, our Father, Father God. Well, that's the children of God. Our would refer to the true biblical church. Now, Jesus also speaks to those who are denying him, even though they're claiming to be the children of God. And Jesus says to them in John 8, 41, and again in 8, 44, oh, your father, your father is the devil. Now, they refute Jesus. They argue and say, no, our father is capital G, God. And Jesus said, no, that's not your father. Your father is the devil. He's been a murderer and a liar, and when he lies and cheats and deceives, he's reflecting his own character, and so are you. So the question that needs to be asked is, who's your daddy? And whose family are you truly in? Now that's a question that Christians ought not be afraid to ask, because Christ is the one who brings this to the surface whether you're looking at him confronting the religious liars or you're watching and listening to Jesus as he's teaching his followers how to pray. The question is, who's your daddy? Which family are you in? Are you in the obedient children family or are you in the disobedient liars and deceived family? It's 2 Corinthians 13, 5 that says, like Paul to the Corinthian church, as God to his children and those who claim to be his children, test yourself and see. That testing begins in part with this question, who's your daddy? I pray you'll take it to heart, and I pray your answer will be the one true living God. But I pray that's not just the answer from your lips, but I pray it's the true, eternal, biblical, missional answer from your life. Amen and amen.